The fifth skillful attitude, transcend suffering. There is a fork in the road every day for us, and it is in our response to suffering, whether it's a tiny irritation or, or something large and tragic. And the fork in the road is this, do I reject suffering or do I accept it? And it doesn't make any difference whether the suffering is self-induced, you know, perhaps I'm a, I'm a mass murderer who's just starting his first night in prison. Um, that is a form of suffering, a form of incarceration. Or perhaps um, I'm a very caring social worker who's just been hit by a car, um, by a drunk driver. That's also suffering. Now you might say one is induced, self-induced, and one is not. That is irrelevant when it comes to suffering. The only question is, the fork in the road is, do I reject this suffering? Do I turn it into a negative emotion? Or do I accept it and attempt it to transform it into something that is good? And that's the nub of transcending suffering. Do I reject it or do I accept it?